Health Check with Nurse Jen is presented by Island Cancer Center. Hoppa day, I'm Nurse Jen. Not all sweat is created equal. Sometimes sweating gets a bad rap. From a health and wellness standpoint though, sweat helps calibrate bodily fluids, cools the body down, moisturizes the skin, and contains antibacterial compounds to ward off infection. Each of your sweat glands is surrounded by a web of nerves. And when your body heats up, those nerves set off a chain of signals. The human body has two to five million sweat glands that pour out approximately 0.6 to 2.3 liters daily. Did you know that your sweat contains 99% water and only 1% uric acid, urea, lactic acid, ammonia, electrolytes, and over 760 different skin proteins? Why does some sweat stink up the whole room while others don't? Perspiration alone doesn't make the stench. Most sweat is odorless, but when bacteria is involved, the odor molecules are created. Smelly sweat can occur from certain foods, such as garlic, curry, or some of those worldwide pika spices. Also, stress can lead to stinky sweat. When the body is under stress, the body's glands secrete a thick fluid that produces a strong acrid odor. And finally, dead skin can garnish a smelly sweat odor also, occurring in areas with folds that rub or chafe together. Dead skin sloughs off and feeds on bacteria. And ladies and gentlemen, bacteria stinks. According to Dr. Bruce Broad, a dermatologist, simple everyday tips you can do to reduce sweat in your armpits include applying aluminum-based antiperspirant deodorants at night when your sweat rate is at its lowest. If armpits are very hairy, to consider shaving it down or using spray deodorants instead. If your groin sweats, one should wear loose shorts to allow air to flow freely through. In addition, research shows that each foot makes a pint of sweat daily. Recommendations include using bioceramic socks or sprinkling foot powder in your shoes. Dr. Craig Heller, a Stanford biologist, also recommends simple suggestions to minimize sweat during a workout, such as using a net cooling collar, holding a frozen water bottle in each hand for up to five minutes to cool the blood that flows into it, and swishing up with mouthwash. The menthol in the mouthwash makes one perceive the air is cooler, hence cooling down the body. Let's meet again next Tuesday. I'm Nurse Jen reminding you, don't wreck yourself, help check yourself. Health Check with Nurse Jen is presented by Island Cancer Center.